Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for October the 5th of 2021. Well, it is titled sunrise at the South Pole. So what do we see here? Well, here we see the sun just peeking over the horizon. And while a common sight, it's a little bit different when we watch a sunrise at the South Pole. First of all, there is only one sunrise each year. So the, at the South Pole itself, the sun will rise. And then once it gets above the horizon, it will remain above the horizon for the six months, setting again in at the following equinox. So here we see at the uh, autumnal equinox, the beginning of fall in the northern hemisphere and the beginning of spring in the southern hemisphere. That is when the sun will just begin to be rising. Now it'll actually rise a few a little while before that because of refraction. Refraction is the Earth's atmosphere which will bend the light pulling it up. So that something that even is below the horizon like the sun here can actually appear on the horizon. So what the time we actually see as sunrise is actually a little bit earlier than when it would otherwise occur had the Earth no atmosphere. And we also see how distorted the sun appears in this image. We're looking through a lot of atmosphere along the horizon and we can see that great distortion as well as the green flash up on top, which sometimes occurs again due to the refraction of Earth's atmosphere uh, through of seeing the as the light rays of different colors pass through it a little differently. Now the sunrise is also a lot slower sunrise at other latitudes is something you can actually watch. This one could actually take weeks to occur. So as it moves around, it will move around the horizon, but it will neither completely rise nor set slowly getting a little more up into the sky. And that process will continue over the next several months. So three months from now, it will reach its highest point in the sky. And from the from the South Pole, that would be about 23 degrees above the horizon. So it never gets very high in the sky, even though it's up all the time, it doesn't do a lot of warming to the South Pole or the North Pole when it's up there because it is always so low in the sky and its light is spread out very much. So while it's up for a lot of the day, it is not uh, it is not giving a lot of direct heat. It's not up overhead as it is at more temperate latitudes during the warmer months. So here we get to see one image as the sun begins to rise, be taking a process that will take a couple of weeks as the sun begins to rise for the next six months at the South Pole. So that was our picture of the day for October 5th of 2021. It was titled Sunrise at the South Pole. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.